Hey guys, we're down at Elite Restoration today working on a wet sand and buff project on our 68 Mustang project car. You guys will recognize this was the one from our paint and body issue. Well, we got a beautiful, beautiful paint job on it, but we didn't get around to the wet sand and buff because we needed to let that DuPont uh, waterborne paint air out a little bit more. So that's why we're down here and we've trusted it in the hands of Santiago to make it look like a sheet of blue glass. Uh, the products we're using today is Mother's Professional line. Now this is everything they make, but we're not going to need all of it today. What we're going to be using is the rubbing compound and the foam pad polish. Now, the difference with the heavy duty rubbing compound and the regular rubbing compound comes down to the pad that you're using. If you're using a little more aggressive pad, use the less aggressive compound and vice versa. The foam pad uh, polish is what's going to get all those fine scratches out and bring it to a high luster. Now if you want to take it one step further, it's not usually necessary, but you can. The machine glaze is the way to go. That has no abrasives in it. And then beyond that is the hand glaze, and that's really just something to touch the car up and make it look beautiful later. That's not anything that's going to work out any type of scratches. Now what's really great is our two main ones, the rubbing compound on the foam pad polish, also available in a consumer version that you'll find at any big box parts store. The finishing polish is the same as the foam pad polish. The rubbing compound is the same as the rubbing compound we're using. It's 100% the same stuff. And of course for maintenance, a little bit of mother's instant detailer. Perfect for when you're going out a car show, you need to get a little dust off. So as good as it looks now, it's going to look even better. Stay tuned to see the after.